Hey guys, today I am going to show you how to add this analog transition to your videos in Premiere Pro. All right, you can see I have created a 4K resolution sequence and I have got three different video clips in the timeline. In the next step, we need some assets for the transition. I already have some assets on my computer. You can download all these assets using the link provided in the video description. Let's drag and drop the whole overlay, spray overlay, text overlay, and sound effects onto the project panel. Firstly, I am going to create a whole analog transition by using this whole overlay. That's why let's move the time indicator to the middle position between the first two video clips. And then we need to move the time indicator six frames backwards. After that, let's drag and drop the whole overlay to this position in the timeline in video layer 2. Then we have to select the whole overlay and move over to the effect controls panel. Now let's find the opacity panel. Next click on the drop down menu of the blending mode parameter. Now we have to select the difference mode from the list. Alright now you can see the changes on the program monitor. In the following step, let's go back to the project panel, and we need to drag and drop the text overlay to this position in the timeline in video layer 3. After that, make sure the text overlay is selected and move over to the effect controls panel. Now let's find the opacity panel. Next, click on the drop down menu of the blending mode parameter. Now we have to select the difference mode from the list. Alright, now we are done. With these couple of steps, we have created the whole analog transition. In the next step, I am going to create a spray analog transition by using the spray overlay. Firstly, let's move the time indicator to the middle position between the last two video clips. And then, we need to move the time indicator six frames backward. After that, let's drag and drop the spray overlay to this position in the timeline in video layer 2. Then, we have to select the spray overlay and move over to the effect controls panel. Now, let's find the opacity panel. Next, click on the drop down menu of the blending mode parameter. Now, we have to select the screen mode from the list. Alright, now you can see the changes on the program monitor. In the following step, let's go back to the project panel. And we need to drag and drop the text overlay to this position in the timeline in video layer 3. After that, make sure the text overlay is selected and move over to the effect controls panel. Now let's find the opacity panel. Next, click on the drop down menu of the blending mode parameter. Now we have to select the difference mode from the list. Alright, now we are done. With these couple of steps, we have created the spray analog transition. Lastly, we need to incorporate the analog transition sound effects to enhance the visual transition. These audio elements will help create a more dynamic and attention-grabbing experience for the audience. In this way, you can add a really simple and nice analog transition in Premiere Pro. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like the video and leave a comment.